Yes, so hello guys, welcome back to Sports Update Ghana. My name is Joseph Adam of you and coming up in this edition, well, Malian football legend, that is Frederick Canuti, has tipped Mohamed Kudus to win the African Player of the Year. Well, we'll get to hear from Frederick Canuti in a minute. But before that, well, yesterday in Spain, well, Black Stars player, that is Inaki Williams and his brother Nico Williams, won the Copa del Rey with their club that is Athletic Bilbao and we're going to check out how they managed to do that right here on the channel but before we get into it please subscribe to the channel if you haven't like share and don't forget to leave a comment my name is Joseph Adamafio and let's get right into it starting off with Frederick Canute, well, the former Sevilla man, spoke in an interview where he was asked about Mohamed Kudus. Uh, well, the Malian international went ahead to what lyrically about Mohamed Kudus, saying that well, Mohamed Kudus is such a good player and looks like one of the players who is likely to win the African Best Player of the Year very, very soon. Let's take a listen to Frederick Canute when he spoke in the interview. Wanted to ask you about African Player of the Year. You won it in 2007, and we've got Mo Kudus. It feels mm -hmm. to me that he's got a real chance of winning it. What, what do you think? Yeah, I mean, I've discovered him not so long ago. Uh, he's really, really talented. He has, he has, he has everything. He has strength, uh, running forward. He can play different positions. Mm -hmm. uh, still quite young, but I think yeah, he's one of the most exciting African footballer around. Uh, these days so yeah it definitely has a chance for me oh freddie thank you for the so that is frederick canuti over there speaking so so nicely about mohammed kudus and mohammed kudus has been doing very well since he joined west ham in the premier league but for frederick canuti he's one of the players who has inspired me a lot his calmness on the pitch and how he moved charlie freddie canuti i miss those days that was why when we went to the afcon in Ivory Coast House. When in time I met the Malians, I asked them about Freddy Canuti because that guy, like, it's not even a wonder that he's now, like, living such a quiet life. And this is the first time we are hearing from him ever since he retired from football. Now, let's wrap it all off with what happened in Spain last night as Mallorca came up against Athletic Bilbao in the Copa del Rey final. Well, there were two Ghanaian players. Or one Ghanaian player with his brother Nico Williams in action in that game. I'm talking about Inaki Williams, who plays for the Black Stars, and his brother, that is Nico Williams, who plays for the Spanish national team. Now they played for Athletic Bilbao in this game and they won the Copa del Rio for the first time in 40 years. 40 years! The same 40 years that has eluded the Black Stars from winning the AFCON. Well, uh, Athletic Bilbao managed to break that record to win their first Copa del Rey in 40 years and they managed to achieve that after they defeated Mallorca in the penalty shootout in their game on Saturday. So this was how the game panned out. Well, it was Mallorca who scored the first win the game through Rodriguez, but their opponent Athletic Bilbao got the equalizer and the game ended 1-1. From there, the game went on to penalty shootout and uh, that was where Athletic Club won the penalty shootout by four goals to two to be crowned winners of the 2023-2024 Copa del Rey title and Inaki Williams and his brother Nico Williams contributed so much to this particular title although they couldn't score goals in the final they are work rates throughout the uh, process of going to the final was indeed such a very very great one. Inaki Williams, remember after uh, the AFCON where Ghana exited from the tournament, he went to play the game against uh, Barcelona and scored a goal in that match. Well, it was in the Copa del Rey and that was the match winner that he scored for Athletic Bilbao to move on to the next stage. When he got to the semi-final, he came up against Athletic, uh, Athletic Madrid and again Naki Williams scored the opening Naki Williams has contributed much to this particular title race and it's such a joy to see him win his third title with Athletic Bilbao. He has won two Super Copa, but winning this Copa del Rey makes it a third title for him since joining Athletic Bilbao. After the final, we still went. Well, 
Inaki Williams and his brother Nico Williams was full of excitement and very emotional and I'll leave you with a video of how they celebrated Athletic Bilbao's success and the Copa de Rey. Enjoy the rest of the video but please subscribe.